when the show came out and were fans are now teenagers. <coughs> They're heading toward college age, and a lot of us got into this sort of thing uh, at college age. So do you suppose perhaps once they get old enough, reach college, are no longer quite so self-conscious and can travel to cons on their own, we'll see perhaps another boom in the population, perhaps. What say you? Yeah, I, and we talked uh, yesterday a little bit about, you know, that fandoms go through a, a growth spurt and then they stabilize. We agree, we think that the fandom right now is in that stable period. New people are coming in, somewhat younger, uh, perhaps more of the target audience, uh, more non-North American bronies. Uh, we are losing bronies. In fact, one thing that we've seen is that some of the social bronies are aging out. In fact, the four bronies I first interviewed, when I went back to them a few months ago, they're all inactive. But they're all in college, one's getting married, one's on deployment in the military. You know, they're, they're, they're busy, but they're inactive. But they all said, we're still bronies, and we may come back and watch more. And so uh, I think we're in that kind of stable period. Also, <laughs> my understanding is that with Equestria Daily and things, that one of the things that are happening is that younger, the younger bronies uh, in general are more into YouTube. And so they, Equestria Daily is sort of like, they don't even know it exists because, and my understanding is Equestria Daily is starting to start advertising on YouTube. So those bronies will know that they exist. And you know, one of the things, um, an article that I read recently is that the internet websites are generally seeing a decline, but YouTube is seeing a real uptick. And um, I think that as technology changes, that um, you know, the bronies are so tech savvy. I mean, really tech savvy. And I think that as the um, as technology changes, they're going to be changing with that technology. It's interesting, just a little aside. I remember when first Facebook first came out, and everybody was on it. My sons were on it, and now it's my age. Yeah, it's old people. It's, it's, it's old people. <laughs> and so that's going to naturally happen. And there's going to be a group of bronies that are going to not be in touch with the newer, younger bronies. You know, who are we have to reach out to in other ways. So. Thank you. Very interesting. Thank you.